FNN. Headline News Update. Hello everyone, Basil Chapman here on this Wednesday, the 13th of April. And we're looking at this 11 o'clock Tiger Financial News Network market update. Dow's up 82 at 34,303. Been a real struggle today, but didn't take out yesterday's low. And yesterday, uh, at this time, we had already made one hour from the high uh, of the start of the slide. It went all the way down for most of the day. This, this time might be a little different. One of the reasons could be that the TLT bonds are at least trying to find some kind of support here so that yields can come down a little bit. I spoke about it in my show, The Tiger Conditions Hour, a few moments ago, and I'll be talking about it this evening when I do it, 4 o'clock to 5.30 when I do my webinar. Uh, the, the title is, um, Can New Highs Be Made in the, in the Key Indices in 2022? But basically, what we're looking at, what sectors will work? What stocks are going to work? What, what is working now? Where, where are we? Can you be in the market and have a little bit of um, a kind of a, a safety factor? I, I believe the answer is a yes. So we're looking at the S&P right now is up as well, up at um, four, uh, up 15. That's good. Up 15 at 44.12. It needs to get to 44.22. And then very quietly by tomorrow, start to get to 44.32 or higher. That's really important at this particular phase. Holding the 200 period moving average, the QQQ uh, turned around from week to a little bit stronger today. It's up at 342. Let's call it 343, up three and a half points. And eh, that's good. It needs a lot more IWM. Held yesterday very well. Then it started to decline sharply. Today it's making up some of it, up to it at 199. Uh, gold is moving up nicely. Just very sad. I prefer this move in gold, which is very quietly moving up. It's in play. It's doing well. It's up six at 1984. Um, it's in the area that's broken out from all the resistance. That's a good sign. Crude oil uh, the in it's, uh, the came with the inventories. I don't know what it was. But in the meantime, back at the... Um, 102.22 area, just in the range. I don't think it's breaking out upside or even breaking down if it starts to trade under 90. It does. As I say, the TLT is acting well. Please join, uh, go to Discord, uh, sign up, and then you'll be able to get to my webinars for subscribers to my opening call. It's a money-back guarantee for the month, but you'll get my newsletter every day, get my weekend uh, updates, you get the webinar tonight, which is archived, plus all my other webinars. Eh. I think it's worth it. And at the same time, um, we're also looking at the big picture. And the big picture is going to be really important for the whole of the year. And that's what we're trying to maintain some kind of a stance. Have a wonderful day. Stay tuned for uh, all the great program. And Larry Pesaventa comes up next. A great program all day. Tom O'Brien wraps it up. Tommy O'Brien starts with at 9 o'clock. Have a great day. See you this afternoon or see you tomorrow.